you know, <clears throat> there's a lot of things that a lot of us would rather do than exercise. Um, it's taken me a long time to really get into the habit of it. Um, I've always liked to be active. Um, and I have, I have worked out off and on um, since I was in college. But um, after I gained 100 pounds, you know, it was really hard for me. I constantly felt defeated. And I talk about now how, you know, I'm a fitness coach who doesn't necessarily get super amped about like getting my butt kicked for an hour a day. And I feel like that's true, but in a sense, I do. I look forward to that feeling that I feel right now. I just finished um, a really fun MMA workout that's for your core. And then I did a little bit of yoga, excuse me, afterwards and I love our programs because they're short, they're fun. The trainers are so encouraging and inspiring. And on the days that I don't wanna exercise, on the, in the times like today where, you know, this fibroid and this endometriosis, it might as well, like I feel like my body is on fire. Um, as cousin Mike says, I have a demogorgon living in my uterus. And that's basically how I feel. If you watch Stranger Things, then you can, you can pick up the metaphor whatever but I love these I love this program because it's something I can do at 242 pounds when I started my journey it's something I could do if I would have been eating probably three to five hundred more calories I would have seen the results on the scale and that's something else that is so important is nutrition nutrition is 90% of weight loss and living healthy you need exercise one for your endorphins two it's like the cheapest form of therapy. Like I just did um, our MMA style workout and she's like, find that thing that frustrates you. And for me, I was like punching my Demogorgon in the face. I was kicking my Demogorgon in the face every time. And they make it fun, they're fast. My first workout today was 25 minutes. That was with a warm up and a cool down. And then I did yoga for like 19 minutes. Exercise does not have to be intense. It does not have to make you feel like you're going to die. Um, I mean, you need to feel it because then it's not doing anything. Like, what's the point? But you don't have to start on some hardcore weightlifting 200-pound workout. Um, and I think that is something that I have found that in these times specifically, like the workout that I did today wasn't on the schedule for me today, but it's what I knew I could do with what's going on and how I'm feeling. And I knew that I always need yoga for therapy, for stretching. And so I think it's just really important for you to understand, and I talked about this on my stories, that when you're deciding to eat healthier or push play on a workout or whatever that good habit is that you want to try to form, um, maybe it's less screen time and more reading books, things like that, whatever it is, you actually have to like write down your goals. You have to set a date. You have to not just set an intention, but you have to make a plan. And you have to find someone to keep you accountable. It was three years in August that I started doing these workouts just on like a random chance that a friend was like, hey, this girl I work with started doing this um, online platform. It's like the Netflix of workouts. I've never ever in my life been able to one, stick with something three years in a row and two, actually see results. Um, I've lost 35 pounds um, just from doing these programs, but I have, I feel good in my soul. I love knowing that I'm gonna get in my app after I'm done talking to you and I'm gonna see all the other ladies who have push play, who have invested in themselves, who are drinking their tasty, delicious superfoods. And we get to stay accountable um, to each other. And a lot of times that is the hardest part. And even, you know, um, going to spin class and doing things like that. Like I had people that I went with, but none of us knew anything about nutrition. And we have to learn what our bodies need. Starving yourself, 12 to 1500 calories for a lot of people is not enough. If you're at a weight loss plateau and you're exercising and you're not seeing results, you need more fuel. You need healthy fuel. You can't live on whatever this coffee is that's supposed to give you energy and suck your fat out or wraps that take out water weight that you're gonna gain back in three days or all of these supplements that promise you quick fixes. Come on, you guys, do your research. You cannot have a true lifestyle change if you do not truly change your lifestyle. It doesn't even make sense. 
eating healthy does not have to be hard. It doesn't. You can still enjoy the things that you love in your life. I love, this is my favorite time of year because dark beer. I drink dark beer 12 months out of the year, but this is my favorite time that I can look outside and see the leaves changing. I can sit by a bonfire and drink a dark, stouty, something tasty that's nutty and I don't have to give that up. No, I'm not gonna drink five of them. I'm gonna have one probably because they're filling, but that falls into my plan. I eat bread, I make pancakes every week. It's my favorite pre-workout. They're good for me. They're loaded with flax and things that, um, you know, give me energy. You don't have to eliminate carbs. If you do not have a medical condition that requires your body to be in ketosis, you don't need to eat that kind of a diet. It's really, 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 really hard to sustain. I did a form of that years ago. Um, it doesn't have to be that hard. You can move your body for 20 to 30 minutes a day. You can eat a ton of tasty, healthy carbohydrates and fruits and vegetables. Anything that tells you that you should not eat fruit, that should be your first sign that, oh my gosh, what's going on? If it grows from a tree, comes from the ground, Potatoes, a baked potato. Do you know how delicious a baked potato is? Scrambling a russet potato in your eggs and putting some cheese on it with some veggies. What's better than that? Some toasted butter on your bread and peanut butter. Like those are the kinds of things that we eat. It is not about elimination. It is about finding the thing that works for your body and doing that thing, please. When I say I don't necessarily love to work out, I do. I can't say that I don't because I do. I love the feeling that it gives me. If you watch my stories this morning, I was not very excited about pushing play on my workout and now like I'm super stoked, ready to take on my day. Nikki's gonna be here in like 20 minutes. We're gonna work. We're gonna help some people get into a new program. We start our fit camp on Monday and it is a true and sincere blessing that I can move my body because I know people in wheelchairs or who have, you know, Surgery is coming up. Well, I have surgery coming up. I'm still gonna exercise and follow my food plan, but that's just me. Um, I know people that physically cannot exercise, and so I have to stop making excuses as to why I can't or don't feel like it. Um, I always feel better when I'm done, and even if I feel like I suck, the only bad workout is the one that you don't do, right? And so I just had to make today work for me, and I ended up having a blast. I feel great. Um, and now I can get on with my day with positivity and eat, you know, healthy. And um, I want to shed a few pounds before this surgery. Um, so I just, I just need you to understand that it doesn't have to be a chore. Exercise shouldn't be a chore. Fun programs with fun music, working out with people virtually in your living room. So if you break down and cry like I've done many times in my life because your body's literally working out the junk that you've been holding on to, like you should really join us uh, for Monday, but today is the deadline. Um, you get access to over 1,100 workouts. There's 86 plus programs. I have nutrition only plans. If you cannot exercise, but you wanna learn about proper nutrition, um, you have access to the best group of accountability ladies in the world. Uh, we do Bible studies together. We're going to start doing um, meetings about actual food online um, to so I can better help people uh, learn about nutrition, the things that trigger them and, you know, to binge eating, emotional eating, eating and how we can overcome those things. Uh, because I feel like finally at this point in my life, I have some value that I can offer from personal experience. Um, but you have access to thousands, I'm talking thousands of recipes, breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks, kid stuff, cocktails, desserts, anything that you could think of. Um, a ton of value for you. I give you all of your grocery lists, all the things you can eat. I tell you exactly um, how much of everything you need to eat in a day so you can figure out how that works for you in your work schedule. You guys, this is like weight loss for dummies, getting healthy for dummies. Like, I'm not kidding. That's why it works perfectly for me because I want someone to tell me what workouts to do on what day, what foods to eat, and how much of each to eat. Like, it is literally the best thing that you're ever gonna do for yourself. And right now, through the end of the week, I have 
uh, I think one, maybe two coupons left, um, depending on if the other person uh, ends up signing up today, but I can save you 10 bucks. So for $159, $169, $219, those are kind of like my program uh, recommendations. I set you up with everything you need. You have everything for a year. You get a free bag of shakes and a shaker. Um, our chocolate superfoods is seriously the best thing ever that I have tasted in my entire life. And I did all the shakes out there, like all these people out there selling their shakes, like I've drank 99% of them and nobody beats our shake. I'm just gonna tell you. Uh, heal thyself with Lindy at gmail.com. Um, you can shoot me a direct message, whatever it looks like for you. Just know that today is the deadline. We start on Monday. We're going to do fun contests and prizes and things like that. So um, just be sure to be in touch with me today. I also have a link to a form I will include on this. Um, so fill that out and I'll send you all the details. And I just pray that you will really consider joining us because being healthy isn't just about our physical being. It's about our mental emotional uh, uh, well-being. It's about taking care of our families and learning um, how to better feed our kids, you know. Um, and so I have, I have resources for you for all of those things. This is not a diet. This is not um, a quick fix. This is true lifestyle change. And if you are willing to give me 30 days, um, you can try this program. Even if you drink the entire bag of shakes and you decide that it's just not for you, I'll give you all your money back. Like that's how much I believe in this product. It has completely changed my life. Um, not just physically, but, um, mostly emotionally, spiritually. And I just, I want to share this with the world because I know if you give me 30 days, you are actually going to see not just how you feel physically has improved, but your mental state. Um, is going to drastically change. And so let's just talk. Let's just have a conversation. Um, I'm not locking it into anything. Um, I just want to learn about you. I want to learn about what your goals are. I want to learn about the things that you struggle with. And so please, let's just, let's have a conversation. What can it hurt, right? Okay, take care, you guys, and God bless.